The owner of the Diamond Princess says the cruise ship will be back in service after it is thoroughly cleaned. But that doesn't mean the industry, the cruise industry as a whole, will be unscathed. Another major cruise line has canceled or changed dozens of trips to Asia as a precaution. Jacqueline Hansen taking a look at some of the broader economic consequences, not just to coronavirus, but in particular to the, the cruise ship, the Diamond Princess, the largest concentration of, of outside of mainland China. What are you hearing from the cruise industry this morning, Jacqueline? Well, we're hearing from Norwegian cruise lines in particular, and it is saying that it is canceling trips in Asia. It says it will not operate trips in that area through the third quarter of this year. And that is because there has been a lot of attention on that Diamond Princess cruise line um, and the quarantine there. This company doesn't want to repeat that sort of situation. The cruise line says that because of the virus, it has canceled, modified, or redeployed 40 trips. And so that would mean, for instance, that 21 of these trips that had been planned for Asia, it is rerouting those to go to the Eastern Mediterranean this summer. Uh, but already, Norwegian Cruise Lines expects that this will have a negative impact on its profit this quarter. The CEO told investors on a conference call yesterday that uh, concern among customers has led to a spike in cancellations there as well. Um, and and that those cancellations, though, they have slowed slightly in the past couple of days. But investors seem concerned by this, too. Norwegian Cruise Lines, their share price dropped by uh, almost 7% yesterday. And if you look at the year to date, so since we've been watching the impact of this virus, it is down 17%. We've seen similar drops, 17% for Carnival Cruise Lines and Royal Caribbean, which has also canceled trips in Southeast Asia. Asia it announced that last week. That stock price is down 18%. But as we see these quarantined passengers head home, Heather, perhaps, Perhaps uh, that might help with customer demand or at least investor confidence in this.